I wanted to be my own woman and know that I can stand my own ground. Jenny Mendoza is a strong, independent young woman. A role model for others. I'm a mentor for like two different programs. But this successful college sophomore has seen her share of tough times. So growing up, my dad did, um, he, he did drink a lot and you know, there was other instances of like uh, domestic abuse. Violence and substance abuse followed economic struggle. And as the family lost their home to foreclosure, education became Jenny's salvation. I found school to just be a home away from home, a safe space for me. When she got to college, new challenges emerged. Her parents divorced and Jenny struggled. And I thought that, you know, those challenges are really what breaks students in college. It's not the academics. Academics you can get help for. How, where do you get help for your life? But being away from home at such a difficult time also proved to be a blessing of sorts. The distance allowed Jenny to see her mom and dad from a new perspective. Just seeing the pain that a lot of women in my community went through and just also the men, you know, there's a lot of toxic, ma toxic masculinity and just all this pressure as well. I think that recognizing that and knowing that that's predominant and that's a very pre prevalent thing in our community really just made me understand how I can not become that. So Jenny made a commitment to herself. I really wanted to just be the change. With her daughter. She'd uh, stay close to her family and community. Jenny wants to be a social justice advocacy lawyer. Her and daughter. So she seeks good mentors of her own, like Cynthia Chandler, director of Bay Area Legal Incubator, a community of lawyers dedicated to providing affordable legal service. So Jenny is super smart, incredibly caring, really thoughtful, and that's what every employer's dream is, <laughs> is to work with folks who are dependable and who have heart and who have grit. Now, as Jenny heads towards summer break, she's looking forward to new opportunities while staying true to herself. I kind of want to just really branch out and go elsewhere and just find the resources I need so that when I do come back, I can help my community adequately, you know, and I can do so. For students rising above, I'm Michelle Griego.